Oh yeah. Imagine jumping over this thing. Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Batch here. Welcome to the Hunter, Call of the Wild. It's pretty cool. But I'd show you that. Apparently we can get up near there. Around the other side there's some sort of lookout. Let me go have a look. I'm gonna find my way through this jungle. And welcome to Hirschfelden. Oh, can hear a chopper. I can get helicopter rides up there. I'll walk. Uh, let's find the road. There's one. Have a map in this game so you can pretty much tell where you're going. You can put little waypoints around on the map. Wow, that's awesome. I probably could jump off that. Need a few many kits. Uh, just got to apparently walk down a few roads and a few caves, and we'll be there. Uh, let's get there. At this point, we're sort of late into the afternoon, and unlike the hunter. This game doesn't stop when it gets dark, it just keeps going. It's got like a 24 hour cycle, so it's pretty cool. We found some cabins up here. Can't go in them. They look nice. Rathen felt something village. There's, so the old Romans live there, I don't know what the hell that is. And here we are at the top. And that's the view you get. Not bad at all. Not sure if we can get to them islands. Haven't tried that yet. Gotta love the reflections of the water. Not a bad job. The game's running smooth at this point. There's been no crashes. So far, so good. It's been a good launch. Let's do some hunting. Before it gets dark. Uh, got us a female road here. Still not used to this gun. You gotta hold it down. And it's a nice headshot. As you can see I'm still near the lakes. Haven't travelled too far. Just walk along a road. And putting out some calls and having a listen. You can pick the calls up on this thing that's in my hand. And here's our road here. And these things are easy cash. As you can see, I've got some cash for killing that. And if you kill it quicker, the quicker you kill it, the more cash and XP you'll get, I think. Now it has turned night. As you can see, I'm just along the road. And they still come to you. The road here. You start with two callers. And just turn my little torch on. Shine a bit of light. It gets pretty dark out here at night. Although there is the moon out, so there is moonlight. So that's pretty cool. I didn't record all my hunting at night. So it is pretty dark. I did record our little friend here, the fox. I sneaked up on the unsneakable. I'm gonna pop a cap in his butt. <laughs> and he's running. But I did hit him.
I think I'll get a mission done. There's missions you can pick up. And there we go. So they give me a thousand dollars or something. What's that? Not bad. I'm saving up for some new guns and callers and ammo and all the good stuff. Uh, so we've hit the fox and then we've got to turn our torch on or else you can't see the tracks. So you just press E and sort of points you in the right direction. I'm not sure if there's little perks and skill tree so it probably levels up through that. And my man's pretty happy. It's pumping, fist pumping. That's some more blood. There's a tower you can put up. That's that sign over there. You just got to pay money and the, obviously they build the tower for you. But it's all in-game cash, so no out-of-pocket real money. Just 30, what is it? $29, I think it was. Very cheap for a game like this. I'm pretty happy with the price. And it's running really good. Looks a whole lot better in daylight though, I've got to admit. But I like the idea of night hunting. Here's our little rascal. Let's see where I hit it. Pretty sure I hit it. Yep. Right up the butt. Good shot. <laughs> I should get extra XP and money for that shot. That's the degree of difficulty. I'm telling you. And I was making my way to the cornfields. And this is first light of day. I hunted through the night. I've got some fellow deer out there. And yeah, it's looking through the scope. It looks that bad when it's far away in this light. It really looks... It's a bit blurry. So you really got to take your time. You know, aim that shot. See the recoil on that gun. I'm not sure which shot hits it. This one, or the first one, or this one, or both. And it's, wow, that's a big recoil. Pretty big this map, I haven't been all over it yet. I think I've been in two or three sections now. I mean, it's huge. And I haven't even been all over them. And, wow, this rain's really loud. They've really gone off the weather effects in this game, I'm telling you. They're pretty good though. <laughs> I like it so far. Here he is. And he's head down in the tree. Uh, next shot. More cash, more XP. I'm heading for the cornfields and the hay area, like in the old Hirschfeld and in the Hunter. I come across a male with a whole bunch of females. Of course, I want to kill the male. Now, I'm using this caller because it's the only other one I've got, and I'm not sure it even attracts fellow deer. It will white tail, black tail, mule deer. I don't know about these deer though. Sometimes they seem to turn and start to walk to you, then they just turn away again, walk the opposite way. It's, I'm not really sure. I have to look it up. But even without the callers, I've got a couple of foxes, so. So I spotted him, so he shined blue then for a minute, or a few seconds. There he is calling. Uh, 
And so if I had to press E then I would have tracked the animal he's called. And then his tracks will highlight on the ground. So it's a pretty good system. It's pretty easy to get used to. It's just the shooting and aiming <laughs> and the tracking I suppose. There he is. Shaking his head. He's walking towards me now a bit. They look very nervous, these deer. A lot of females. She's running pretty quick. What's he going to do? He's not that far. See a lot better with the binoculars and the gun scope at this point, but I've probably got the cheapest or it's a free gun and scope and so you have to buy them, those skims here. And hopefully that hit it in the lung. Hit a vital. And it'll bleed out really quick if it hasn't been dropped. Very slow reload on these things. Alright, we've hit it and it looks like a lot of blood. So that's a vital hit. So that won't be too far away, hopefully. Wow, it looks nice around here. Look at those mountains in the background. A little big turbines there, like in the other Hirschfelden. And here it is. Yeah. It looks like lung blood. Yeah, left lung. So it died pretty quick and probably gave me more extra cash and XP for a vital hit. And now I had a female roe deer. And I sort of snuck up on. I went for the headshot. Just so it didn't run off, hopefully it sort of brain shot it. Still really early morning at this time, at this point. Pretty much <laughs> walked all night hunting. Pretty fun. And this is our store. This is our um, camp. And this is the rifles you can get. So there's a lot of rifles. Handguns. Shotties. All the ammo. And you just buy all this with in-game cash. So you just got to hunt to earn the cash and do um, missions help too. Different clothes, they're pretty cool. And all the scents that you need. Part range finders, everything. Yeah, so you got to find this place and now you can spawn here all the time. Instead of starting it wherever it is. Even the flag comes out and you can sleep in that little hut. 
Well, you got to pay, I think, to sleep there if you need a rest. I've got another idea here. But I'd have a hunt while it's sort of in the middle of the day and it's nice and sunny now. The sky looks really nice in this game. The grass, the wind movement. It's really been done well. It's been done really well. <laughs> uh, where'd it go? I'm sort of aiming for a heart shot. Obviously, I didn't hit the heart because it's running away. But I think it's super far. You can see the call of the other animal there. And there she is. There you go. Some extra cash. Let's buy that better gun before I know it. I want to go to Lake and Lakes and I want to have a good gun when I go there. One that'll kill a bear. There she is. I was going to shoot it in the head, but it turned really quick, so... Got the chest. Oh, that's pretty cool. There they are, a little scroll. I don't think you get any points for killing those. So I'll let him go. Marlboro deer. Went prone and I couldn't see, so I had to crouch up. Well, that footsteps. that in the chest I'm wounded and I caught up with it eventually And so as you can see, you come out hunting, you do get animals. There's a lot to shoot. You've just got to be a bit patient and quiet. There's some feral hogs, or boars, sorry. Wild boars, but I'm not going to shoot at them. Because my gun won't kill it. It'll just run and run and run forever. So I'll let that go for now till I get a better gun. Which won't be long. And you save up money really quick in this game. And down here I found a, apparently there was a drinking area. I think now it stays on my map because I crawled down there. I could go for a shot at that, but yeah. I think I'll just go down instead. As you can see, I sort of <laughs> went down here. I didn't die. I just stayed crouched. So that's pretty cool. They can sort of come down the side of that cliff like that. I'll show you how, how steep it was. So your movement isn't too restricted in this game. You can go pretty much down anyway a lot of places. Look at that. I went down there. Not bad. I 
And I heard a fox. And luckily enough, just by crouching and waiting, he came my way. You can tell when they're really close with the calls though, so I knew it wasn't far. And I hit that. Although there's one running across in the background. So there must have been two foxes. Together. This apparently I come over here to get some mating calls for some mission. For the fellow deer, so I don't know. And that was me hunt guys, hope you enjoyed it. I did. I'll be back here really soon. Sorry that it was all a little bit here and there, but it was just my first hunter scout around. And next time I'll be doing a better one, hopefully at Leighton Lakes. See you next time guys, thanks for dropping by.